One of the parliament's important jobs is to scrutinise or closely examine the work of the government. In question time, members of parliament do this by asking ministers questions about the government's actions and decisions. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Prime Minister. Yesterday, the National Farmers Federation released its drought plan. Today, the National Party backbench released its own plan in response to ministers going missing on the drought. When will the Prime Minister release a national drought strategy? Question time takes place in the House of Representatives and the Senate at 2pm everyday parliament meets. In accordance with Standing Order 43, the time for members' statements has concluded. Questions without notice, the Leader of the Opposition. It being 2 p.m. Move to questions without notice. It lasts about one hour and is one of the most watched parts of the day. The public galleries are often full and many of the journalists and photographers in the press gallery at Parliament House attend. Thanks, Mr Speaker. My question is addressed to the Prime Minister. By Christmas, 160,000. The Prime Minister and Ministers are expected to answer questions about the government's actions and decisions. The first question of the day comes from the opposition. Then government and non-government members ask questions in turn. On the government side, only backbenchers ask questions. There are rules about how question time is run and strict time limits on the length of both questions and answers. A question cannot be used to debate an issue or argue a point. Ministers must give answers that are relevant to the question. In the remaining time, he needs to at least outline what the policies are if he's going to outline what the risks are. Otherwise, we'll move to the next question. Can the Minister update the Senate on how Australia's military contribution to the Middle East is supporting efforts to increase security and stability in the region? Senator. Government backbenchers ask ministers about what the government has achieved, how it is addressing an issue or how it is responding to a crisis. Would the Minister please outline to the House what this government is doing to address the tragedies in relation to uh, youth suicide, mental health and... This allows ministers to provide information about the work the government is doing. Ministers plan these questions with the backbenchers. These types of questions are called Dorothy Dixes. They are named after a newspaper advice columnist who wrote her readers' questions as well as the replies. I say to members, if they wish me to hear these things, they shouldn't carry on like a soccer crowd. I didn't hear what the minister said. I'm finding it very difficult to hear what the minister said. As well as keeping a check on the government, the opposition wants people to see it as the better alternative. Opposition questions often focus on mistakes the government may have made or weaknesses in a minister's performance. Ministers must be well prepared so they can answer these questions immediately. A lively part of parliament, question time is covered by the media. It will report if the government performs well in question time or if it does a bad job of explaining itself. For the public, question time is another way to find out about the work of the government. This is our Australian Parliament. To find out more and how you can get involved, visit the Parliamentary Education Office website, peo.gov.au.